All right, so I want to show you guys how to do a screencast where you just capture anything on your screen. Um, you go to QuickTime Player, mine's down here, but if you don't see it down there, you can just go up to Finder, type in QuickTime Player, and it will show up. And then once QuickTime Player is up, you just go to File, and you can actually do a movie recording, um, you can do just an audio recording, or you can do what I'm doing right now, which is screencasting. So while this is going, I just want to show you um, how you can take make uh, you know quick videos for students or students can make videos so if I go to photo booth I'll open that up real quick so in photo booth um, you can take pictures you can take video um, and then what's cool about it is it saves it in photo booth automatically so kids don't need to know how to save anything um, you'll have the option to save it if you want to save it to like your desktop and upload it to YouTube um, I'm sorry photo booth's taking a second here um, but basically, you'll be able to, kids don't have to do anything. When they click this, um, it, it will just start going. So actually, I go here, it'll start the video. My camera's off right now, but like my daughter's made this the other day. This one's cake, um, cake. And then I just right click and I can press export. When I do that, I have the option to save it to my desktop. Um, but once again, it just, it, you don't have to do that. It'll save it in here. Um, but that way, if you want to do something more with it, you can save it outside. But for kids, they just press record, stop, and they can make a video of themselves reading, explaining something. It's kind of a fun way for um, kids to use technology while also, you know, maybe hearing themselves read. So that's how you do that. Uh, when you are done with your recording, you just go up here and press stop, and they'll end it.